hi guys in this video we will be doing nfs from a windows server to a linux server we have both the instances running one is linux and one is windows also we have taken session into both of them as you can check and this is our linux so let's get started first i'll show you the output of the fmh as you can check these are the mount points currently into the linux and here we are in the windows server here there is a drive d drive and this is a test folder which we will be trying to get it into a linux server via nfs so let's paste this text file here just to get a gist so this text file contains nothing okay so let's get started so first uh, we need to do few configuration in windows for that we will go to server manager here we will wait for it to get started yes it is go to manage add rules and features next 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 okay so in server rules here is file and storage services and then file in is csi services inside it we can check that server for NFS is mentioned. We we'll add features. I'll go a little up so we can see the bifurcation. That's it. Go to next, next, and install. Okay, we'll wait uh, for it to get installed. It will take hardly 30 seconds to one minute. Okay, so installation is completed and we can close it now it is saying restart is pending but it's not required you can directly close it and after that we need to check connectivity first so first we will go to cmd and we'll try to ping to the destination server so destination server would be the linux one so here it is we will take the private ip and enter so as you can check we are trying we are able to get ping from the server so the connectivity is established that's it then we will go to the directory that we want to do nfs suppose this is the directory we will do right click properties nfs sharing manage nfs sharing share this folder let's give it a name let it be windows nfs and then we'll go to permissions here we need to do few changes it will be read write let's give it full access okay apply okay and close so that's it these are the settings to be done from the windows end now let's go to the linux server so here we are so now here we are first of all let's go to the root directory here we need to create a mount where we will be doing nfs so let's create a directory for that uh, let's give it a name as let me give my name okay so a directory is created okay, let me make it full screen so now we'll run the command of nfs it would be mount hyphen p nfs and then name would be the server ip that is the windows that is the ip paste forward slash or colon forward slash now here will be the file server name which we give it will be windows nfs space and then where will be mounting it the directory which i created that's it hit enter it's done and now if you check df-h as you can check that the mount is present let's go in it and check if the text document is present or not yes it is here also let me create one more file here test2.txt yeah test2 is present now let's go and check into the windows server if the file is present or not yeah the file is here so this is how we can do nfs from a windows server to a linux server i hope this video was useful to you guys thank you